Hello YouTubers and welcome to a new video of Arepas for Dinner. For the ones who don't know me, my name is Andrea and I make videos about my life. I'm currently living in the Czech Republic and on the last video I guys showed you my grocery haul for the week or whatever, um, but that was such a lie because I just purchased another um, batch of things. So I'm going to show you what I bought today and how much it costs. Um, and Alicia is just showing me here that I forgot two bananas. So yeah, let's start with the video. So, I'm sorry you're hearing Peppa Pig in the background, but you know how it is. So the total was 2196 but I especially bought something very expensive. That is these, the Aqua, aqua Pure, uh, pure like, uh, wet ones. That only was 850 crowns, but to be honest, these last me, the last one I bought last me four months, so I hope this one lasts me four months as well. So here is everything. Um, this is just completing my previous uh, grocery shop, so I'll just show you more or less so you have an idea of the price of the products more than anything, and that said, I usually love to watch these like videos where people buy things and say how much they cost them, I don't know why. So that's why I'm making these and I hope you enjoy it. So this corn for popping, for making popcorn was 79.90 Czech crowns. Quite expensive, but I honestly like making my own popcorn once in a while. So it's quite small, it's only 500 grams. I buy this like once every three months or so. I also got this wine, yeah, super important. That one was 90 Czech crowns. Um, it's from Spain and Spanish wine is my favorite type of wine and we didn't have any red wine. So yeah. I got here a rustic baguette that was 41 crowns with 90 cents. I bought two bananas that my baby Alicia already had a piece of one because of course that was 15 crowns 16 cents. Alicia has been feeling bad in the, st bad in the stomach so my mother-in-law suggested to give her this tradichny sukharki that is kind of like this dry bread that is good when kids don't want to eat anything because they're feeling bad in the stomach so that's what I did. This one was 41 crowns 90 cents. Then I bought the salami for 29 crowns 90. This is for making a pizza that we're gonna make today here homemade. And then we bought some sausage 96% for 56 crowns 90. Um, Alicia loves eating sausages when she's feeling all right. Then I bought these protein bars that are quite expensive. They're 39.90 each, so I pay 159.60 for all four of them. But to be honest, these are my lunch way too often. And sometimes I don't have time to have lunch, so I just grab one of these ones. Now, as you figure right now, I am a popcorn addict. This entire box kind of like pops and becomes hot, like tall in the microwave, like in the photo. It's very, very cool. It cost 29.90 Czech crowns and I bought four of them. So it was 119.60. Um, yeah, I know the other popcorns are cheaper, but you have to put them in a bowl and then wash the bowl. These, you just keep them in the box. And to be honest, I love that they only have Himalaya salt and not weird seasonings. Then I bought this apple juice. This is usually the apple juice that I buy to Alicia. It was 21.90 each. So it was a total of 43.80 Czech crowns for the two of them. Then I bought Rohlix. Rohlix are these like little breads. I don't know if you can see them. Um, Alicia loves them. So she's now having those for breakfast once in a while. So I bought four of them. Each is two crowns 90 cents. So, so inexpensive. So four of them was 1160 check crowns. Then I bought myself this big uh, snack globasa or this like sausage thing. It's, it's, they're very small, but I love to snack on these. This was 43.90. Then I bought two of the capsic. This is Alicia's favorite snack in the world, literally. Something between cheese and yogurt. <laughs> She's screaming there. And it's $23.90 each, so it was a total of $47.80 for the two of them. Then I bought some Red Bull, because if you've seen my post, I am literally going insane with everything I have on my plate at the moment. So I don't have these daily, but if I need it, I'm going to have it. And it's that Red Bull because I'm watching my weight, you know how it is. So each of these are 38.90 check crowns, so a total of 233 check crowns for something that it should last at least three weeks. Then I bought four of these uh, Jabelko or like apple juice for 44.90 each, a total of 179 with 60 cents. 
Um, Alice is liking the other one, but I cannot find the this one every time. So I rather buy um, some other brand to see if she likes it because she's quite picky with the brands of things sometimes. Then I bought this Zanetti Parmigiano Reggiano. Um, this was 37. 0.90 check crowns. We use this a lot. It's super fresh. I keep it in the freezer, by the way. You can do that with Parmesan cheese. Just saying. And we just pop it out whenever we're going to have pasta or lasagna or something like that. And last but not least, I got Jamon Serrano um, for 61.32 crowns. This is from Rohlik uh, Butchery or like Charcuterie. And it's so good. That's exactly why that's the reason why I bought the baguette, because otherwise I would have just baked the bread at home, but I don't know how to bake baguette or it takes too much work. So that was it. And then with all that, we have a total of 2,196. So what do you think about it? Is it expensive? Is it inexpensive? I wanted to post this here because I feel the last grocery haul that I did was quite a lie because literally today is the very next day and I just spent all this money. I decided in this vlog as well to bring you with me to Tesco. Isabella is sleeping at home. Um, she's being taken care of, of course, she's not alone. So I decided to bring Alicia. She really wanted to go for a walk. Yeah, wow. She really wanted to go for a walk. So I decided, oh, why not? Let's go to Tesco because um she doesn't have enough pyjamas and shirts neither like long sleeve shirts or short sleeve shirts and i'm i'm kind of tired of the onesies with her i think she's over them so we're gonna go to a local tesco which is pretty small and doesn't have many options but maybe we can find a couple of nice things for her i usually don't buy anything for isabella because as you know isabella is only one year and two months younger than alicia so she wears everything that Alicia wore or even things that Alicia never had the chance uh, to wear. She does have a few things on of her own, but it makes no sense to buy her like daily items like t-shirts or like, you know, trousers because probably Alicia just wore them like twice before giving them to Isabella. Wow, they do have some Valentine stuff this year in case you're wanting to buy something to your significant other. Alicia likes something, so let's move fast so I don't have to buy it. Okay, so this Tesco is quite small or at least compared to the Super Tesco we usually go, but it's hard to go to any of that with the two of them and living in Isabela for so long, I don't like it. So let's see what they have here. So definitely I'm wanting to buy some leggings and Alicia liked the mini one. You liked it? You want it? Okay, we're gonna buy the mini one for her and probably like one dress or something like that. Okay, I'm gonna check that out and show you. So, she mini. This one is 250 crowns. It's not the cheapest, but it's okay. She really likes it and I know Every time we put her something she really likes, she lets us dress her up, which is a huge accomplishment. So the leggings are almost for 100 crowns. I, I don't think I wanna pay that for leggings. So let me check what else there's, they have here. So I found these ones for 239 um, and I think I'm gonna get this. They're perfect to be at home. As well, I'm gonna be getting one of these little dresses. It's only 199 crowns and I find them so cute. And usually now we're at home all the time, so she can wear something like comfy, but it's also cute. That would be nice. Oh my gosh, I died. Um, this is 129 check crowns. It's so perfect for some Valentines. And I'm, I think I'm gonna get it if there's in her size, let me check. There's nothing on her size, which is a shame because it's uh, for younger kids and the one for her size is 239 check crowns and I don't wanna pay that. And here is more like the baby section, but they definitely don't have like t-shirts. I really wanted like short sleeve t-shirts because inside the house is quite warm because of Isabella. And they don't have, they have like long sleeve 
like these ones let me see how much they are it says 299 i think for the three of them um yeah 299 i don't know i don't know okay let me let me think about it no i mean there is some in her size but i don't think i want to get that so i didn't need anything and i was checking if there was like anything like valentine's day for me and there is but like i don't know 269 crowns for this i think jan would find that like ridiculous i don't know why so and of course every time we're in the supermarket we need to get her one roslik so here we go yay So the trick is every time you get your kid a rohlik in the supermarket, which is the most check thing to do, you just tell the cashier that you did. I mean, in the case of Alicia, I don't think she's gonna eat it before we go because we're going like right now. But in the case she, the kid finishes the rohlik before you leave, you just tell the cashier like, hey, we had a rohlik and they just add it and that's it. So the total was 689 crowns with 90 cents. Um, that was the t-shirt was 249 the dress was 199 and the leggings were 239 um which is okay and then the tax so you have an idea i mean the the tax on these things was 119 check rounds because the tax here is 21 percent 21 percent that's insane so of course it's raining because that's my look. So probably I'm gonna see if it rains more, but I'm just gonna close the roof of the stroller and we're gonna stroll back home. But as you can see, Alicia is not feeling her best. She's there like licking the raw lick, but she's not even eating it. Like she has been sick stomach wise for almost a week. So of course my look is raining and I had to put the rain thingy. I think I've used these like one time only and it's funny Alicia doesn't seem happy maybe she's gonna stop asking to go for a stroll when the weather is so bad so probably I'm just gonna cut the video here now for good um, thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe and to give this video a big thumbs up also you can follow me on my social media I'm gonna write it here so you know what it is and nothing I'm gonna be trying to post at least once a week sometimes more depending on if I did something interesting or something I wanted to share with you guys and that's it see you next time with a new video bye